stop's gonna be the company store to maybe get some new kicks. Wah. Hello world, Uncle Heavy. Guess where I am today? I'm in Beaverton, Oregon, and I'm getting a special tour of the Nike campus here in Beaverton. So, no tickets required to get in. I'm gonna see what kind of trouble I can get into. Do come along. This is how I'm starting my tour. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Yes. My legs keep getting clogged. <laughs> so up here is the new Serena Williams building that is currently under construction. This is just the entrance from the parking garage. I think I want to work here. And I want to point out the uh, brand new pair of Nikes I'm currently wearing, for the record. I'm walking through Nike. All the flags that represent all the nations that Nike does business with. And here's the main entrance. Right here, if there is an athlete that is on premises, they will hang a banner representing them. I'm gonna just get a, a photograph of the outside here. So this is basically a tribute to how it all began. Here's a model of Jeff Johnson's van. Here's a little tribute to Steve Prefontaine who was one of Nike's original athletes. This is the Waffle Trainer. It was designed by Bill Bowerman and it was actually made with a waffle iron. One of the original waffle irons found on his property. So the design of the campus was actually made to represent a college campus. I have to point this out. There are these bicycles that are pretty much available all over the campus for the employees to use. That's kind of cool. Like with your employee number, is that how it works? There's an app on the phone. and okay. some, You have like a ready, you have an account and you just go in, hey, I'm at this bike. Right. I want to just give you a, a quick look of what I'm seeing here. This is like no other work building I've ever seen or worked at. These here are all designated wetlands by the company. And they bring in students, college students, high school students to do biological work. So this is located just outside the Tiger Woods building. Uh, this is a replica of the Pebble Beach uh, 18th hole tee. And if you see, across the field there is a mirror of the green. And they say he'll come here and actually replicate the shot on occasion. Notice they even have a ball cleaner right here. So cool. And there he is in real life. Well, not real life, but a representation of him in real life. This here is the Sebastian Coe building. It's relatively new, quite modern. And I think if we go underneath it, I'm going to see the reflection of myself in the glass. Hey, if you look, there I am right there. That's me. <laughs> Like Disney. One thing that really seems to impress me about this whole campus is the very laid back, casual atmosphere of the way the staff is dressed, and it's not that stuffy, button down, stuffy shirt sort of environment. Everybody is wearing, of course, Nike products and sweatshirts and jeans, so. Whoever came up with that concept is kind of genius. Nature. Doing the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is a great 
mantra here. Squirrel. So this is the LeBron James building. And as you can hear, there's some construction going on right now. But I wanted you to pay attention to this ramp that's going off the side of the building. That is not a parking structure. That is going to be a testing platform for runners to climb. Wow. They don't mess around at Nike. Okay, I just wanna take a moment to show off this building. This really awesome looking building is actually a parking structure. This is the kind of detail they take into making it really neat looking around here. So, very cool. That's about as much exercise as I wanted to do today. So I suppose I should expect an endorsement today maybe. Nah. They have this nifty little ramp here so you could push your bicycles up and down the steps. Cool. This is the New York parking garage so they gave it kind of a colorful urban graffiti look to it. Nice full-size chess set which it appears is kind of in the middle of a game. Oh yeah. Let's see if I can do this without hurting something. Look, they even have box ball. Gotta get a shot of this. This is definitely not something you see every day. Just a 360 of the buildings and the outdoor eating and work areas. Right, so this is the other end of the Tiger Woods. Was it Pebble Beach 18th hole? This is a replica of the green and we're way across the field. I'll see if I can get a shot and show you the distance. Across there is where we were before. That's where the T was. They even collect used sneakers here. And sand volleyball, beach volleyball. Have a wall climbing facility here as well. So they have a Japanese garden here. It's a nice shot across the pond. I have to say this is probably one of the most amazing business campuses I've seen. And it, it is very much set up like a college from what I've seen so far. A random statue of somebody fishing right here. You are, are creepy. Okay, I'm gonna take a walk out on what actually used to be a boat dock. At one time you could take a boat out here and go for a row around the pond. So on display they have a, a brief history of the Air Jordan and the evolution of it year by year. The gold ones are actually shoes that were game worn by Jordan himself. This here is the original 85 that everybody wanted. Never ever got to get one though. Got my new Nikes on there. Got a little Bo Jackson memorabilia here. Interesting sculpture hanging from the ceiling. So if you notice, I'm pretty much staying my tour to the outside of the building. That's because the interiors are pretty much just office space and there's obviously no videotaping allowed inside, but the external campus is awesome enough. Who is that handsome guy with that camera right there? Oh yeah. This is what I believe to be a Nike time capsule, 1992. So they even have this nice little running track that goes around the campus. See this padding here? 
Remember the bin with all the recycled sneakers? They manufacture this padding out of it. And this is the entire field from a distance. So it goes to show you how many recycled sneakers they can use and make a foam mat. There's this guy running up the hill and I'm gonna beat him. I'm gonna beat him, I'm gonna beat him. Ha 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 ha! Wait, look at this. Isn't that cute? Somebody put a pine, uh, pine branch in his hand. How clever. I'm kicking his butt up this hill, that's right. That's right, you remember. You remember, you remember. They even have a regulation track to run on here. Huh. That's about as far as I'm going. I want all you people watching out there to know what I do for these vlogs. For some reason I thought that would be really, really cool theme music for that sign. I don't, I don't know. Just, just me being weird. And this is the view of the main entrance if you were to come in. Well, up above where you'd come in. Cookie. So, that's going to do it for my little tour of the Nike World Headquarters. Really hope you enjoyed it. It's a little different than some of my other vlogs, but I'm trying to get a little bit of variety here. So, um, if you enjoyed it, I'd appreciate it if you threw me a like down below, or maybe even consider subscribing to my channel. From Beaverton, Oregon, I'll be signing off. Until next vlog, bye bye Yeah, right. <laughs>